Okay, you're given this. And what you're asked for is to find the value of both A and N. All right, so let's take a look at this. And the first thing I'll do is just expand it using the binomial theorem. And I need those first three terms. So it's going to be N, N, and then it'll be 1 to the nth power, and then AX to the 0 power, right, this over here. Let's write the next term down. It's going to be N, N minus 1. Then you get 1 to the n minus 1 times ax to the first power. Just writing the first three terms down. n, n minus 2, 1, n minus 2 times ax to the second power. And let's just, you know, compute these things over here. And, you, know, um, you know, the first term is just going to be 1. The next term is going to be, uh, let's see, n, ax. And the next term, let's put this one down. A little more complicated, isn't it? It's going to be, let's see, well, let's write this down. n over n minus 2. That's going to be n factorial over n minus 2 factorial, 2 factorial. So that's going to give you n, n minus 1 over 2. And then what are you going to get? You're going to get a squared, x squared. What are you going to do now? Well, equate. What are you going to equate? Well, the 1 equals 1. That's not a problem there. Let me point out what I mean by that. This 1 equals this 1. Let's go to the next one. And, you know, 30, I'm equating coefficient, by the way, is equal to Na. All right, that's pretty simple. And I know that n, n minus 1, a squared over 2 is equal to 375. All right, I'm going to take the first equation. There's two equations, two unknowns, by the way. And I'm going to solve that for, <coughs> for A. And what do you get? You would get 30 over N. I'm going to take this, plug it in here. What do you get? N, N minus 1. Well, let's see, A squared, that's going to be 30 over N squared over 2 equals 375. So I have, one equa I have an equation of one unknown now. Let's figure it out. Uh, what are you going to get here? Well, that's going to be 900. I can multiply both sides by 2, by the way. That's going to give me 750. And let's see. Uh, one of the n's cancels off. Get n. And then n minus 1. All right, let's keep doing this. What do you get? 900n minus 900 equals 750n. Let's see. That's going to be 150n equals 900. And n is going to equal 6. Well, I was expecting an integer. I got one. So I think I know what n is. n is 6. Put a box in that. And what's a? a would be 5. Let's look at the k. See if we got that. n is 6. And um, a is 5. Again, there's work down there. If you work for a reason. I like to put the work down so you have something to look at. Um, you know, whether you look at the videos or the work, it leads to the same answer. Thank you.